friends, today I'm sharing with you five items that I have purchased that have saved me money. Lots of money. Welcome to Freedom in a Budget. My name is Kelly and my channel is all about living a full life well on a budget. I make videos every single week. I have cash flowed my wedding, paid off $23,000 worth of debt, paid for a Jeep Cherokee in cash, which was about $25,000. And we are currently saving $100,000 for a down payment and closing costs on our first home. We have a little over $33,000 saved. I make videos every single week on grocery hauls, on budget videos. I get real personal, line by line, how much money we're bringing in, what we're spending all of our money on, and get down and dirty with you. I also share losing weight on a budget tips, just random money tips that I have as well as just share with you my personal life. So today I'm teaming up with my girl Kim from Free to Family. We're gonna share five items that we have purchased that have saved us money. Lots of money. And I will also have a blog post as well at freedominabudget.com where I share even more tips and tricks with you guys. So be sure to go over to freedominabudget.com, check out the blog post, and I hope that you subscribe. Now, let me know down below in the comments what is something that you have bought that has saved you money. Let me know, I would love to hear from you guys. So don't forget to comment on this video, like it, share it with a friend, as well as subscribe if you have not already, and go check out Kim from Free to Family. Let her know that Kelly from Freedom in a Budget sent you. She is so sweet, so gracious. I have been watching her channel for quite a while now, pretty much ever since she started her channel. It is so motivating. I get so many tips from her. Absolutely, absolutely love her. Love her. And you're gonna you're you're not gonna regret it at all. So let's get into the tips. The first one is LED bulbs. So I was really hesitant on LED bulbs. Jamie, my husband, is a lighting designer. He does all of the like big concerts and big corporate lighting shows, and he is a lighting guy. So when he said he wanted to invest in LED bulbs, I thought it was a waste of money. I was like, we can buy a light bulb at the Dollar Tree when you wanna buy these Philips Hue light bulbs and do all this stuff and get all fancy and all this stuff and I thought it was a waste of money. Now, when I looked at the stats, I realized how much money they save over time. It is incredible how much our electric bill has gone down since we got LED bulbs, it's crazy. And there are times when he leaves a light on all day long. Yep, it happens. And you know what? At first I'm like, oh. but then I realized, okay, that's costing us like 25 cents, if that. So it's okay, it's okay, I don't get as mad anymore. And yeah, so they're really cool. Now I have my phone here and I will show you what we can do with this LED bulb. So I'm gonna have you look at the lights back here. Just keep your eye on this light. All right, you ready? So we can turn it off. We can turn it on, we can turn it all the way up, or we can turn it all the way to whatever percentage we want, which is so cool, as well as change the color temperature. So as you can see, the temperature is changing, which is so cool. So let me see if we can bring it back to what it was. About 30%. So you can change all the way up to 100%, down to zero, 26, we'll do 30%, which is so cool. So cool, guys. So that is LED bulbs. They are incredible. I absolutely love them. And we can control it from our from our phones, which is so cool. And we have pixel lights behind our TV, behind our pantry, all of things like that with the pixel type. It's really cool. So really, really cool. Next up is my Instant Pot. I absolutely love my Instant Pot. I'll be honest guys, I was really nervous in the beginning. So many people talked about explosions and this and that and all this crazy stuff and people burning their face off and I was a little intimidated, but I did a lot of research on how to do it. Like when you're doing the release to make sure you wear oven mitts or use a like spatula or spoon or something like a wooden, long wooden spoon, something like that. So you're not getting the steam. Making sure you're not looking over the Instant Pot and doing it so the steam comes up. Like just different common sense tips and it has been a game changer. It completely takes the excuse out of forgetting to thaw out meat. 
complete takes excuse out of I need to get fast food or I need to stop at the drive through or something like that because you can put raw chicken in there raw frozen 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 guys chicken in it or any type of frozen meat and you can have dinner on the table within 30 minutes that's incredible and to me that takes all of the excuse out of fast food and having to stop for dinner or get takeout or something like that there's been so many times in the past before my instant pot where I was like I forgot to take meat out. Oh, sorry. Guess I have to go and get dinner. Nope, not anymore because I always have chicken or I have something in the freezer that I can throw in there. It is amazing, guys. The Instant Pot has saved me so much money already and I've only had it for a year, year and a half. I think it was a wedding present. No, it was a birthday present. So I've had it for exactly one year because my birthday is this week. So exactly one year. It is completely paid for itself probably at least three or four times. So Instant Pot is a must. All right, next up is a silk pillowcase. Guys, this is like a dream to sleep on. I absolutely love sleeping on this silk pillowcase. I'll be honest, it was a little weird at first. It took like a night or two to get used to the texture because it is different than normal cotton pillowcases, but it is, it's amazing. It, I've noticed such a big difference in my skin, my hair. It helps with split ends. It is just a great beauty product. I am really trying to get better at investing into my hair and my skin and everything now that I am turning 30 or I actually just turned 30 last week. And I actually did a video with Marissa the Budging Wife on things that we bought in our 20s that was good purchases. And one of the things that I talked about was investing in good skincare. And I have really tried to up my game in that and I'm starting to see some wrinkles come in and so I'm trying to help combat them and make sure that I'm more intentional about my skincare in my 30s than I was in my 20s. So silk pillowcase, my grandma always slept on a silk pillowcase, always, always, always. And I always thought it was crazy. But now that I look back, she had beautiful hair. And so, you know what? I'm investing in a silk pillowcase and it is gonna save me lots of money over time in beauty products and different things like that by, and it's, what's like, $20, $12, something like that. I'll have it linked down below in my Amazon shop for you guys. Next up is tools, tools to fix things. Now, these are some of Jamie's tools. These are, these are actually pretty heavy, um, but just a screwdriver, drill, all sorts of different things he has in here that I don't know how to use too well, but tools. Tools are amazing and different things around the house to fix things. We have had lots of things break around the house and he has been able to fix them, which saves us so much money. I recently had a, have a mic stand that I keep my mic on when I film and it's an old, old piece of furniture that I just kind of use as a mic stand and it's a perfect height. It's awesome. And it broke because Piper jumped on it and I think it fell over or whatever it was, but one of the things broke and I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to go out and buy something new. I don't even know what's gonna be the right height and everything like that. And I was like, that really stinks. Then like three days later, Jamie was like, oh yeah, by the way, I fixed that for you. And I was like, what? So he just went and drilled some new holes and put some stuff and fixed it for me. And I didn't have to go out and spend $100 on a new mic stand, which was incredible. So different things like that, it really saves money over time. So investing in good quality tools will be a game changer. And there's things like YouTube where you can go and figure out how to fix a garbage disposal, how to fix this, how to do that. It is amazing what is available for free on the internet now. So cool. All right, guys. I say this one for last because I know that it may grow some people out, but I hope it's I hope you stay to the end, guys. It's not as bad as you think it is. So, next up is a menstrual cup. So, I started using menstrual cups 3 or 4 months ago. I'm still pretty new to them, but they are incredible. I was really hesitant. I didn't know how I was going to like it, if it was going to be messy, if it was going to be hard, if it was going to hurt if it was gonna like be gross, if I was gonna have leakage. I, I was really, really concerned. But I did a lot of research and I found these on Amazon. I'll have them linked down below for you guys. This came in a two pack and I think it was like $11. So they are awesome. What I do is I boil them after every cycle. So I wash them, like hand wash them with like soap and water. In the middle of my cycle, every time I dump it out and then 
on the at the end of the cycle I boil it and then right before I'm about to use it I just precautiously boil it again for like 10 minutes made of sterile um, silicone grade medical grade um, silicone so you don't have to worry about anything like that so they're so safe I'm not gonna get into like too many details of how to use them or anything like that there are plenty of videos on the internet about that but they're awesome I don't have to worry about leaking I don't have to worry about anything and it saves me so much money on tampons and pads and everything like that I do use a panty liner just to TMI but just to make sure that you know there's no I've always used them but I never had anything on it but I just feel better with using a panty liner so that is that menstrual cups save so much money you don't have to use tampons or anything like that which is like what $15 a period times 12 it saves a lot of money so one time two pack it comes with also this thing that I've never used but it comes with it it is like let's see here it is a little carrying case if you want to put it in here so it comes with this as well I've never used it but it does so menstrual cups game changer game changer guys if you're nervous about it just give it a try give it a try first time I did it I did it at home after work for like four hours because I didn't want it like to be stuck in in me for all day at work and then not be able to take it out so the first time I did it I just did it at home for a few hours and I was like oh I can't really feel it this is great and honestly guys I absolutely love them love them all right guys that is five things that I have bought that has saved me money let me know down below in the comments what are some of the things that you have bought that have saved you money over time don't forget to go check out Kim from Frida family let her know that Kelly sent you and don't forget to subscribe if you're new coming over from the collab from Kim's channel I hope that you subscribe and join the family and if you haven't met Kim yet go check her out go subscribe to her she's incredible you will not regret it all right guys I will talk to you later bye